Welcome back. You know, Tuesday's Valentine's Day, and you have that special guy in your life. You may be wondering, what do I get him? I have the answer for you. <laughs> Expert uh, Tara Claflo is here this morning, and you say the women have a harder job buying the perfect gift than the men. Definitely. I feel like guys can so easily fall back on the flowers, chocolates, lingerie, but ladies, we're kind of stuck. <laughs> so my idea is to try to treat this like any other holiday and just really think about what kind of guy you're shopping for and get him a great gift that he's going to love. And I brought a lot of things from Legends Outlets Kansas City, Brooks Brothers Factory Store and J. Crew Crew Cuts. Um, so the item that I'm most excited about here are these urban ears. Um, these are kind of the big hot new item if you've got a techie guy in your life. Um, we used to always do those little earbuds. Everyone was trying to find the littlest earbuds stick in their ears. No, that's out. Now we want big over-the-ear headphones. How, can, how much would someone thing like this cost you? These how are, much would it set me back? These are 50 bucks. So okay. really easy. 50 bucks, you're in style, your man's happy. Exactly. What's next? No. These are my other favorite gift. And as I talked about earlier, Valentine's Day doesn't just have to be about your lover. You can also pick up something for your dad or your grandpa. And these Brooks Brothers books over here are hilarious little anecdotal stories about how a gentleman should behave abroad, how a gentleman should act at dinner. So especially if your men's been a little naughty lately, this is the way to go. This is a polite way of saying, you need to shape up your act. You're but trying I to still... square him up. That's exactly. what's going on. You want to get him right. Okay, so that's when it comes to reading, you have something for him. We've talked digital. Yeah. How about some nice shoes? Because yeah. nice shoes complete the look. For sure. And so today I brought these to boot New York shoes. These are from Saks Fifth Avenue off Fifth. And these are brogues. This is really coming back. And this is a great refined look. These can pair perfectly with a suit or be dressed down with jeans and a button up. And just these little perforations, they're also called broguing, hence where brogues get their name. And I think they're just a great guy for any age. You have so much here. We want to get to this watch. Tell me a little bit about this watch. And you haven't mentioned any prices yet. Let's just give them yeah. the price. This is our big ticket item. This watch is $350. Um, it's a Braille watch. It's you know made with Swiss and Italian manufacturing. It's got the Swiss technology, but the Italian luxury. And it's got these hints of rose gold, which is really coming back. We saw a lot of gold and silver for a Honey ears, but now rose gold is all the rage. And if you needed something to carry all of these gifts for that special guy, you brought a nice little, you don't call it a purse though. It's not a purse. <laughs> don't call it a purse. <laughs> this is a weekender bag. This is great for that businessman. If he's got a lot of stuff, if he's on an airplane, give him this. This is a Jack Spade bag. Love the two tone leather. Great brand. At 324. 324. Okay. The weekend, what do you call it? Weekender back. All right, weekender. Don't call it a purse. Make your man happy. Get out there and get shopping. Thank you so much Not for the problem. excellent advice. Oh, my goodness. There you go. Happy Valentine's Day to everybody.